Tell me what you see in me Gotta be my name is Kennedy for those of you who don't know and for those of you who don't know welcome back to my channel So as you can tell by the title of today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my 2023 hygiene routine This video has been highly requested because if you're new to my channel I do a lot of like routines like morning routines, night routines, self-care day routines, a whole bunch of routines And I have not done really like an in-depth of what I use for like my overall hygiene routine So I'm going to be doing that today Today's video was sponsored by Trust Wellness Hi everyone, so I just wanted to stop by really quick and mention that today's video is sponsored by Trust Wellness. So thank you so much Trust Wellness for sponsoring today's video. Trust Wellness is an at-home waxing kit company and they were so kind enough to send me their popular waxing kit. If you know me personally, like my mom, my sister, then you know that I definitely prefer waxing over shaving because number one, shaving takes forever for me, like forever. And number two, for me when I wax my hair out and grow back to like a month or more and when i shave my hair will go back in two days so i mean two days a month you know so when i received their kit i instantly and when i tell you instantly i mean instantly fell in love because i'm able to wax in the comfort of my own home okay so first i'm going to show you guys what the kit comes with okay so first we have the waxing pot don't mind it i've waxed like twice with this kit already so i have like wax all on the thing but this is the waxing pot where you put like the beads and then the beads like warm up inside of the pot and then you have the little nozzle for like the temperature so the kit does come with five packs of hard wax beads so i already used two of them because i've waxed like i said twice but the ones i have right now is the tea tree one the lemon one and the eucalyptus hard wax beads the kit also comes with the pre-wax spray as well as the after wax spray and then we have some larger wax sticks as well as the smaller ones to get like you know on your face like your mustache or like your eyebrows and the bigger ones like for your legs your armpits wherever and then it also comes with a couple of protective collar rings to put around your wax pot just so you don't like ruin your waxing pot with the wax dripping from the stick and then you'll also receive a beginner's guide for waxing which is definitely really helpful if you don't know what you're doing this is the packaging it comes and it's super cute and then it also has everything that comes in the kit like on the side of the box down here also for the waxing warmer you can remove the pot as well if you need to clean it now i'm going to show you guys a couple of clips of me waxing with the waxing kit so before i do the wax i'm going to put on this pretty wax spray okay so i'm just going to spray it all over my legs now i'm about to do my first wax thing i'm so scared i'm acting like i've never ever waxed before when i have yeah i'm gonna turn it up i like when it's like warm because like it feels good so i'm supposed to wait until it's like not sticky anymore so it's able to be peeled off ready Okay, so I'm going to continue waxing the rest of my legs. Okay, so I just finished um, waxing my legs. I'm about to do my stash. So I'm gonna get the smaller sticks to do that. I'm just gonna do like the sides first. Then I'll do like up here. Um, Cause that's where like I have a lot of hair like on the sides. So um, my legs like literally look so freaking good right now. Like they look, they're so smooth and soft. Ready? Three, two, oh! Okay, so I'm going to use to get the residue off i'm gonna like spray the after wax spray on it since i'm a homebody and i love doing things at home this kit was definitely the perfect thing for me this product is listed on amazon so if you would like to purchase this kit for yourself or a loved one then you guys can go ahead and click the link in my description box to purchase the kit once again thank you so much trust wellness for sponsoring today's video and let's get back on with the video Before we get started, I do want to make a little disclaimer, just a little tiny disclaimer. All the products that I show work for me and work for my body. Everyone's body is different, so just because if you tried a product that I used in this video and it didn't work for you, doesn't mean it doesn't work for me. Just want to say that really quick before I get into anything. So these products right here that you guys can see, these work for me and work for my body and help me stay fresh all day long. Everybody's body is different and everybody's body will react a different way when using different products, so I wanted to make that little 
disclaimer really quick okay so first things first before we get into the actual product a big 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 part of your hygiene is drinking your water i am not gonna lie to you guys i am not a big water drinker like i am not a fan of water like if i have the choice between water and soda i'm gonna pick the soda but for the last couple of months i've been trying to drink more water and a big tip is to get something that you actually like drinking out of like for me if i have a cute cup or a cute water bottle i'm gonna drink that water because it just motivates me to drink it because i'm drinking out of something cute i don't know if that's just me but that just helps me like if i like what i'm doing like if i like what i'm looking at and like what i'm and like what i'm drinking out of i'm gonna drink it often and i'm gonna keep refilling the cup and refilling the cup and refilling the cup and water plays a big part in your hygiene it's good for your body your skin everything your overall health your overall body you need to drink your water okay so if you're not a huge water drinker like i am like i am then get something you like drinking out of like a cute water bottle or they even have like those motivation water bottles as well which i'm gonna get one of those too where it has like the times and like when you have to drink the water so i think that's really helpful as well if you're just carrying that water bottle around with you all day i think that'll help you a lot okay so now we're going to get into the actual product first category is oral hygiene so for my toothbrush i use the fairy Will toothbrush you can find this on amazon honestly i prefer electric toothbrushes over like regular ones because i feel like they just get my teeth more clean i don't know but i think electric toothbrushes are way better than regular another reason why i love this toothbrush so much is because of all the different modes it has there's whitening clean sensitive polish and massage so that's kind of one of the reasons why i love it so much there's like a little charging port you don't need to keep replacing batteries you just charge it and once it's charged fully it'll last you for 30 days 30 days this is not sponsored or anything like it but if you want to sponsor me very well you can do that because i love your toothbrushes okay okay next is floss i'll either use floss sticks or the floss string personally i like the floss string better i kind of just use like floss sticks if i have like something stuck in my tooth like right then and there or if i'm like on the go and i can't you know get into my teeth good i'll use a floss stick but when i do have the time when i'm at home at night and in the mornings i do like to use string floss so i definitely would prefer string over the sticks but it's good to have both flossing is honestly a must because it'll help your breath smelling way better because sometimes the floss can get things that a toothbrush can't okay so next is toothpaste i kind of like to switch between two different toothpaste so i either use the crest pro health gum detoxified toothpaste or i'll use the sensodyne one i don't remember which exact sensodyne one it was because i haven't got it recently but i like to switch between the two sometimes because sometimes i'll get sick of this one and i'll go back to sensodyne sometimes i'll get sick of sensodyne and i'll go back to this one there is like a downside to these toothpaste they taste disgusting they have the taste is horrible they don't taste good at all so that's kind of like the downside of it but both of the toothpaste were really good so i definitely recommend trying either one next is the mouthwash i use i use this listerine fresh mint mouthwash this is honestly the best mouthwash for me it works so well and i tried tons of different mouthwashes and this is the only one that has worked really well for me it keeps my breath smelling fresh all day long like all day Okay, that is it for oral hygiene. Now we're gonna get into our shower routine. First, we're gonna start off with our wash day products. So I'm not gonna give you guys a full in-depth of like my wash day routine. I'm just gonna give you guys the products that I use inside of the shower. So I start off with the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Shampoo. This shampoo works so good and it has like really strong minty scent. So he's my, my hair smells so minty, like it smells so good. I've tried tons of different shampoos and this is the only one so far that I have found that works well with my hair. A lot of the shampoos that I've tried in the past have made my hair feel very brittle so i don't like that feeling that's not how you're supposed to feel dry and brittle it's supposed to feel nice and soft and silky and shiny and all that so this for me definitely recommend this and then i also use the same like kind of the conditioner as well but i did run out so i can't show you guys the bottle but this is what the bottle looks like and then for a deep conditioner i use the shea moisture jamaican black castor oil deep conditioner which is the same as the shampoo and conditioner but it's just in the deep conditioner form and this literally keeps my hair so shiny my hair has grown so much just from using this product definitely like recommend this if you need a new deep conditioner or if you haven't tried a deep conditioner a deep conditioner is a must for a wash day routine like it's a must and then to go along with the shampoo i forgot to mention that i also use a scalp massager a scalp massager is really good to to get the shampoo really good in your scalp so you can just you know scrub it a lot of people like to use their hands but i feel like this this right here works way better than using your hands so just to like you know scrub it and get it and it just feels so good okay now into the washing my body so with soap i'll switch between a couple different dubs there's like three dubs that i switch between but i don't remember this, the third one 
but I'll either switch between the Dove Aloe and Eucalyptus body wash or or just the plain aloe body wash and then to like wash my body I'll use a loofah loofahs are way better than face cloths because face cloths hold so much bacteria you guys they hold so much bacteria so a loofah or an exfoliating rag is way better than using a face cloth because a loofah and an exfoliating rag hold way less bacteria than a face cloth does the bacteria like it's just insane so loofahs or an exfoliating rag okay so now we're gonna get into exfoliating shaving all of that stuff so a tip which is something that i just recently learned a couple months back you have to exfoliate before you shave yeah so i used to shave and then exfoliate but then i kept hearing things about how you need to exfoliate before you shave and i looked it up and i was like oh that makes more sense when you exfoliate first you're allowing the exfoliator to remove all the dead skin cells before you shave that'll help the razor just glide right through your skin so you're not causing any irritation or razor bump also i know a lot of people don't know this but do not exfoliate in every shower do not exfoliate every time you shower it'll cause irritation like it'll just make you feel very it'll, it'll be very painful do not exfoliate every shower so for exfoliators i'll use either the the tree hut watermelon sugar scrub this smells so freaking good you guys like this smells so good or i'll go with the dove exfoliating body polish in pomegranate and i haven't tried any of the other ones but i think i'm gonna try i forgot i think it's like coconut or something i think i want to try that one but this for me has been so good it smells amazing it was over a year ago when i started purchasing this and i bought it every single time i ran out ever since and to actually exfoliate my body i'll just use exfoliating gloves Okay, so now we're gonna get into like the waxing portion. So the razor that I'll use is the Venus Comfort Glide White Tea Razor. If I'm feeling lazy or don't want to wax, then I will shave in the shower. But if I'm not feeling lazy, then I will use this waxing kit right here. This waxing kit has been the best waxing kit ever. It's from Chess Wellness, which is actually the sponsor of today's video. So thank you so much to them for sponsoring today's video. That waxing kit, y'all, top freaking tier. You can find it on Amazon if you want. If you want to know more about them, then you guys can go to my description box to purchase the waxing kit kit but the waxing kit comes with everything that you need to wax at home it's literally the perfect thing to wax at home with and personally waxing is way better than shaving for me because the wax when you're waxing it lasts longer than when you're shaving okay so the last thing that i do in the shower is wash my face because all that steam you know builds up in your skin you just need to wash all that off so the first thing i do is i'll wash my hands with my cetaphil gentle skin cleanser this is also the product that i use to wash my face with you gotta make sure you wash your hands really good before washing your face and also when washing your your hands before you wash your face if you wear like press-ons or acrylics or any type of long nails you need to make sure you're cleaning your nails with a nail brush because you have a lot of bacteria in your nails especially like when you're eating like i don't know freaking chicken chicken wings like barbecue chicken wings buffalo chicken wings any type of chicken wing all that stuff in your nail it's just in your nail and you're just washing your face with the chicken stuck in your nail so it's really good to have a nail cleaning brush before you start touching your face so like i said for the cleanser i use the cetaphil gentle skin cleanser i live by this cleanser it's the best thing that's ever happened to my skin ever so when cleansing my face in the shower i'll either use my hands or i'll use this large exfoliator or i'll use this tiny exfoliator and then after my face is all washed i'll hop right out the shower and to dry my face off i will use a paper towel it's best to use something that is disposable instead of using your towel to dry your face off with definitely use a paper towel or something that's like disposable when you're drying your face off after you wash your face instead of using a, your towel okay for that that is it for my shower routine now we're gonna get into our skincare routine after the shower so the first thing i'll start off with is this cetaphil toner and to put the toner on my face i'll use either cotton balls or cotton rounds after i use my toner i'll go in with the kills hyaluronic acid serum and then after the hyaluronic acid serum i'll go in with the kills glyconic acid serum after i apply my serums i'll either go in with the cetaphil moisturizing lotion or the kills facial cream and then the last step in my after shower skincare routine is i'll apply this kills avocado eye cream next we're gonna get into our after shower body care routine so if i do shave in the shower i will go in with this raw african shea butter and this is the type and this is very raw because it's the type of shea butter where you like have to put it in your hands and it melt into your hands so it's like very raw even if i don't shave i might put this on but this keeps your body feeling so moisturized the whole day the whole night and it makes your skin like glow this in the summer with your nice tan girl and then for body lotions i'll either use the asos body lotion and pomegranate raspberry this will keep you smelling good all day and it'll keep your body moisturized all day long so this right here buy it right now buy this right now okay if i don't use that lotion i'll either go in with the gingham love by bath and body works body lotion this smells so good as well like mm, every time Ooh! 
makeup. Oh, it is disgusting. Ew. Got in my mouth. Ew. Oh my god, my makeup. And then for a body butter, I'll use the Butterfly by Bath & Body Works Whipped Body Butter. This body butter feels amazing on my skin. It smells so good too. And pairing this with the Butterfly Perfume, it just smells so expensive. You smell like really rich and expensive and it just smells so good. I also forgot to mention that for deodorant, I use the Dove Cucumber and Green Tea Deodorant. This works amazing. It keeps me smelling so good all day long. It also smells amazing. So definitely recommend trying this out. And then for the last things in my after shower body care routine i'll pair my favorite scents if you're not new to my channel then you already are gonna know what i'm about to say these together heaven okay you smell amazing first scent is the citrus green apple by dossier and then the second scent is the fresh getaway mist from bath and body work these will have you smelling so clean expensive or rich like everything like these two scents together perfect it's the best combination i've ever found in my life they smell amazing together so that is the end of today's video i hope you guys enjoy that is my 2023 hygiene routine if you have any product recommendations definitely let's definitely tell me in the comments because i definitely would like to try some new products as well i always like trying new products just to see if there's something that i like better than what i'm already using so thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video bye